What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech and this is the Nia Casa Nomo N3. This is the latest and greatest from Nia Casa. This robotic vacuum is a 3-in-1 system. It's a sweeper, vac, and mop all in one. It has four vacuum suction modes ranging between 650 PA, which is quiet mode, up to 4,000 PA, which is the strongest suction power. It has the latest navigation mapping system. It has built-in voice control using Echo or Google devices. Alexa, start vacuuming. Start cleaning. It has auto sensing. It will detect tile and carpet. And when it climbs up on carpet, it will kick in more suction power. It has auto charging and self-emptying up to 45 days of vacuum bag use. It has staircase edge sensors. Max run time, 320 minutes. It will run around the house. That's around 2,100 square feet. It has multi-floor mapping technology using the app. And you can even create no-go zones. Wow, this thing is beautiful. Here's the old design. And this is the new design. As you can see, this thing it sits a little bit higher up. And this is where you store the water, right here. This is the charging pads. This is the cleaning brush, right here. This is the dustbin. And it has Looks like three filters in one. And this is where you put the water, right in here. Be sure to empty out the water every time you're done using it. This is the main brush. It's easy to remove and maintain. This is the LDS laser mapping technology right here under this. Right here is a slam bumper. It has a rubber strip right here. So if it does collide into anything, it's not gonna damage that furniture. Uh, it comes with an extra brush, which is nice. And here's the user guide. There's the mopping pad and the HEPA filter. And this is the attachment for the mop. This is the charging dock and self-cleaning bin here's the charging pads right here look on the side right here there's a sensor on the side looks like another sensor on this side and on the bottom right here there's rubber feet and looks like there's access so you can remove any clogged pet here which is nice all right and on top right here this is where the vacuum bags go it does come with an extra bag which you could put right here. And then the back right here is your cable management. All right, so let's go ahead and connect this on. There we go. Be sure to download the Nia Casa app, and then go ahead and sign in, register using an email and password. Select your robot N3, select using the app for location, and then go ahead and turn on the unit by holding down the power button for seven seconds then hit next step. And then to connect the Wi-Fi, hold down the two buttons on the unit at the same time for about seven to 10 seconds. Select next step and then go ahead and put in your password for your wireless router. Network connected. It takes about one to two minutes to connect. Once you connect, go ahead and select the right arrow and continue to update the firmware. This takes about one to two minutes. The vac needs to be over 50% battery life on the charger. Charging. The vac will reboot and then you'll be able to go and use the robotic vacuum. Click on the bottom right hand corner to adjust the water level and suction power. Go ahead and tap on the upper right hand corner to schedule a cleaning. I chose 10 o'clock 
and then go ahead and confirm and select done if you want to save it. If you want to activate a no-go zone, it's easy to do. Go ahead and select on the left box and then go ahead and adjust on the map where you want to locate the no-go zone. This will block off the robotic vacuum. This is how if your robotic vacuum gets lost, select call robot and select remote control if you want to manually control the robotic vacuum. For first time use, make sure the robotic vacuum maps out your whole entire house. That figures the robotic vacuum detected my hand and turned instead of picking up all the cat food. But it looks like my dog got the rest. The suction power is quite powerful, as you can see, it picks up most of the cat food. Start dust collecting. The self-emptying robotic vacuum, of course the vacuum feature is the highlight, but it does mop and it does a decent job mopping. If you're interested in the Nia Kessa for yourself, check out the link in the video description below. Hopefully you found this video informative. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. If you know anyone that might be interested in the Nia Kessa No More and 3, click on the share button below, share this video to them, help someone out. Subscribe and hit that bell notification to stay updated on the latest tech videos.